See this list right here? This was the end result of what was about to be an eight to 10 minute video or so, and then I was editing it and realized we need to start over. Looks like a pretty great list. And it is a great list. It was the result of this analysis paralysis that I was stuck in and trying to get this video started, but then the video got too long. So I figured I just wanna walk you guys through this thought process here so that if you're stuck on something, you can get out there and get to the task. All right, we all end up in some sort of analysis paralysis because of a couple things. And this was the result of thinking about where people are at one month into 2019. There are some people that are executing and dominating off to a fantastic start. And then there's other people that are stuck in either, I need my plan to be perfect, or how do I get going? And that's where analysis paralysis comes in. So I came up with this list because this is how I actually got to making this video of four things that we can do to get to the task when we're stuck in this analysis paralysis. The first thing is to take action, take some sort of action. Now, if you're stuck and you're trying to make phone calls and you're like, I don't know who to call, it's hard to take action on making that call. So take action some way or form. Don't take action by going on social media or just doing something else to distract you. Change your venue. Maybe you need to go talk to some people in person, talk to a few people in the office to get the energy level up so that you can make the call. Take some sort of action. What I did with this video is I turned the camera on, hit record, and I took action. You're not gonna see any of that stuff because it was way too long, but it got me to this. The second step is to minimize your distractions, right? When we start taking action, we'll start to get distracted. Well, I could do this, I could do that. Minimize the distractions, stay focused on what you're doing to recharge yourself so that you can ultimately get to the task. If you need to turn off your computer or turn off your phone or lock the door to your office or whatever it is to minimize distractions, make sure you do that. The third thing is plan ahead. Now, if you're already here in this analysis paralysis, we already screwed this one up. We didn't plan ahead, right? We didn't have an idea of what we were going to do in order to get the task done but that's okay. What I'm talking about here is plan either your next steps once you've taken action and minimized distractions or create the opportunity to plan for next time. This is why we have all of our clients do a planning meeting at the beginning of the week. This is why I do a planning meeting so I know what's coming up. The thing that I forgot this week was what to do with this video, but we figured it out. The fourth thing to do is to just keep going, right? You Once you take action, you minimize distractions and you get some sort of a plan together, we're like, all right, great. Things are going and then we're like, I can reward myself. Fight that urge, keep going on what you're doing. If you got two phone calls into your call session, make another. Keep the pace going because the task is going to get completed better or you're gonna get more tasks done if you then just take that energy and keep it going. And now this little word up here that I wrote, can't. This came out of because the reason why a lot of times we get stuck in analysis paralysis is because we think we cannot do something. And this is gonna sound cliche, but I'm gonna say chop off the T or the knot and stick with the can. Every time I think about being stuck, I think of Robert Kiyosaki and Rich Dad Poor Dad. Now that's a book about money and everything, but this actually works with getting out of analysis paralysis. Rich Dad told Robert, don't think about what you can't afford, think about how you can afford it. So when you're looking at your tasks and you're stuck, think about how you can get unstuck. Think about how you can move forward rather than, oh, I can't do that. Follow this plan, take action on something so that you can feel a little win. Then minimize distractions, plan on how you're gonna get it done and then keep going and you will be able to get it done. So think about how you can approach it in a different way so that you can see some results. No more can't, just that you can get the task done by following this step. Kick analysis paralysis in the butt because you guys can do it. I know that everybody has big goals. I got a big one, it's right up there a million dollars, right? That's a big goal. You guys got big goals too, but I'm confident that you can do it if you follow this plan. So guys, have an awesome day. Kick out your analysis paralysis. If you're still stuck after following this plan, shoot me a message and we'll get you unstuck. Talk to you later.